Good morning, my friends. It's Stephen Walashik from Prime Lending, and today's Tuesday. It's February the 6th, and that means it's time for Tuesday's Two Minute Tip. And today, we're talking about qualifying for a mortgage if you have high balances of student loans. Believe it or not, I've already done three videos on this topic, but if there's one thing that's a constant in the mortgage business, it's change. And once again, we have change, so I'm doing my fourth video and the most current when it comes to qualifying on student loans. Uh, so, big change was Freddie Mac. Freddie Mac was a real popular option last year. I helped a lot of people with Freddie Mac who had student loan balances that were high because Freddie Mac allowed for income-based repayment. So you could have $100,000 in student loans and a $5 minimum payment each month and I could use or we could use that $5 for qualifying. Well, that recently changed. Freddie Mac now says we have to use a minimum of a half percent of your aggregate balance of student loans. So if you have $50,000 out there in student loans, we have to use $250 a month for qualifying. If you have $100,000 in balances in student loans, then we have to use $500 a month. Fortunately, Fannie Mae is still allowing for income-based repayment. We can either use what's on the credit report or if you have documentation on income-based repayment, even a zero payment, we can use that. But that's the last option now when it comes to having high balances on student loans, unless you're a veteran. If you're a veteran, reach out to me. There's some different nuances there where you could have deferment for 12 months and that will count for zero payment. And then there's different calculations for student loans altogether with VA. But now, for all of them, for Fannie, for Freddie, for FHA, for rural development, anything that's in forbearance or deferred, 1% minimum balance, so $50,000 means I have to include $500 against you in your monthly payment. $100,000 balance, $1,000 a month. So it's getting more and more challenging to qualify for a home if you have a lot of student loan debt. So if you have any questions about that, I want you to reach out to me. Also, reminder for those locally here in Kalamazoo County, tomorrow is the day for Guys Who Give. Again, 5.30 registration at Tibbs Brewing Company, downtown Kalamazoo with a six o'clock start time for the event. So that's Tuesday's tip. <clears throat> Don't forget about Guys Who Give. Reach out to me if you have any questions about student loans. Listen, as always, I thank you for tuning in, hitting like, commenting, and sharing, and as always, Make it a great day.